Hi guys, welcome to another episode of our tutorials by Levenotion Studios. This is Super Sam once again, and in this very episode, I'm going to show you how you can restore Blender 2.8 back to factory settings. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel if you've not done so. Let's get started. <music> There are different reasons why you want to restore back to factory settings. One of the reasons could be you messing up your key map by mistake, or you installed um, different add-ons, and these add-ons, because they are clashing, they've affected the functionality of your Blender scene, or you have, uh, or you just installed a new version of Blender and you want to use the original settings from the factory for it. So these are a few reasons why you want to restore. And I'm going to show you how you can quickly do that. So um, you go to, but first, I want to show you how you can uh, restore your preferences first. You come to edit and then you click on preferences. Now, this preferences has to do with the key map and uh, some other switch stuff in here. Okay. So to restore the preferences, all you need to do is click on the load and save button here. And then you come to load factory preferences. So once you click on this, it's going to restore everything that has to do with preferences in Blender back to the default settings. So this is one. And another restoration you can do is come into file, go to default and load factory settings. Now, when you click on this, this is going to help you restore your Blender settings everything that has to do with this current version of blender that you installed and um, it's going to restore it back to the factory settings even with uh, the preferences the the startup files the key map everything will be restored back to the default settings so this is more like a general cleansing for your blender uh, installation if that makes sense so this is where i'm going to call it a wrap i hope you've learned one or two things from this video don't forget to like the video, subscribe to our channel if you've not done so, and until next time, keep your creativity blending.